Alright, so... Looks like I can't stream anymore until I get decent internet. <clears throat> I stopped, one, because I had to go to the bathroom. But two, because I wanted to check my stream quality. And it is abysmal. And it's not the... Like, the sound is fine, which is actually the part I was worrying about. No, the problem that is the, uh, the big issue is that I have really bad internet to the point where... I'm full. To the point where it will lag. It, it, it's where I skip parts of the video. So... Basically everything I went over in the last video I'm gonna have to re-go over in case anybody cares, but I don't think anybody does, I'm gonna do it anyway just so I have something to talk about. Because I am not the most interesting of people, but I do my darn best to be somewhat entertaining. Come on, you butt. Oh yeah, my energy's high, so I mean, my accuracy is going to be abysmal. But anyway, so I'm going to go over those topics that I went over in the last video slash stream, whatever. But I guess from now on I'm going to just only record and then post videos. So if some things are out of order, uh, I do apologize. I'm going to try to uh, order them in parts. Uh, probably starting with my next series, whatever it is. Um, it would be a lot easier if I had a decent recording setup, but I'm only using the PS4's recording capabilities. So... So, um, what do I want to go over first? Uh, there's only two things I remember talking about in the last video, so I guess those will be enough to go over. Also, I'm going to be looking at the clock very often now, so it's about, so probably about 10, 15 minutes, so it's 9.30, and it's 9.28 now, but I'm going to round it off to 9.30, so about 9.45. Alright, so, uh, I'm going to try to arrange my videos about 10-15 minutes long, that way they are a decent length, but also so they don't take five days to upload. And, uh, you know, the longer it takes a video to upload, the more problems it can possibly have in the uploading process. So, anyway, um... So one thing I remember talking about in the last video was uh, the fact that I used to speed in games when I was little. Um, these games consisted of... Excuse me! Thank you. What? These games were uh, Crash CTR for PlayStation 1 and... Where is this guy? And Jack and Daxter for the PlayStation 2. Um, and I was speedrunning these games back when I was, um, about five or six. I, re I remember I was in Montessori school, uh, which is basically, um, uh, pre-kindergarten and kindergarten. About 2003, I believe? So, um, I used to speedrun these games mostly because... At the time, I didn't really have a memory card for either systems, and I wanted to see how fast I could beat these games. And I ended up being able to beat Jack and Daxter in about an hour and a half to two hours. I believe it was an hour and a half to two hours, because I... Um, usually at the Montessori school, because... Okay, at the Montessori school they had... Um, for the big kids, there was a big kid room, and I was at the little, you know, the little kids, there was a little kid room. And the little kids, probably about three and four, somewhere around that age, and the big kids had to be in, like, uh, basically kindergarten. And 
um, one day, well, uh, I'm getting ahead of myself, uh, in the big kid room there were video games, and that is the only reason I wanted to be in the big kid room, it was just so I could sit in there and play video games all day, and they wouldn't ever let me do that, because I would go outside, you know, you need to get outside and do stuff, and I'm like, I don't want to, I just want to play video games all day. But, um, one day in particular, um, they went swimming because there was a swimming pool out back and I didn't bring my swimsuit. I didn't bring it on purpose because I knew that if I didn't bring it, I could stay in. And I was the only one who didn't bring their swimsuit. So I was left alone in there and, uh, they knew I was a, not a troublemaking kid and you know, whatever, so they're just like, okay, just if you need us, we are, you know where we are, so just come in, where do I, I don't know where I need to be going, um, and that's what they told me, is just come and get us if you need us, so I obviously didn't need them, and it was, I had just started, like I was probably after the, I think I was after the tutorial in Jack and Daxter, and they only spend maybe maybe an hour, sometimes two hours outside just so nobody gets too tired, nobody gets sunburned. And you know, everybody's a little kid, you know, so it kind of made a lot of sense. And by the time they had gotten in, I had beaten the entirety of Jack and Daxter and everybody came in and they were really shocked that I had beaten the game and they were like you know how did you do that did you, like what and they didn't understand because they thought I just like glitched everything and I, di I didn't I, uh, I did a glitchless run and I just did everything as fast as I could now I didn't 100% it of course but I uh, I just got through the game, getting as minimal of the uh, uh, power cells as I could. Now Crash CTR on the other hand, I didn't play at the Montessori school where in Carmen San Diego do I need to go. I played it at home, I never had a memory card for my PlayStation 1, uh, but I had a lot of time on my hands when I was little, so I proceeded to play Crash, and ended up beating it in 45 minutes to an hour, I believe. Um, maybe an hour and a half, depending on how good my run was. But I didn't know speedrunning was a thing at all. I just thought, you know, hey, I don't want to do these games as fast as I can, and so I can see the ending. Oh, that's the other thing I wanted to talk about. Um, so, uh... Let me check the time. But yeah, that's um, that's my speedrunning story. I don't really speedrun anything else nowadays. I just kind of play games to play games. Now there are some things that will speedrun. I uh, speedrun Uncharted 4 because I thought it was that was a fun game. Oh, finally, Amazon. Um, I did it for the platinum. I never want to do it again because I had a horrible time doing it. I wasn't having fun and I, I enjoy shorter speed runs that don't take much time. I will go probably upwards of three to four hours, maybe five, and I, Uncharted 4 took me five hours, but and I know that's not a good time for Uncharted 4, but I got the Platinum and that's basically it. So, um, uh, on the subject of beating games, I, uh, when I was little, I never wanted to beat games. I, wow, this looks really nice. I never really noticed how nice this game looks uh, on PS4 at 60 FPS. But I never wanted to beat games, and it's mostly because, from what I believe, I didn't want them to end. And it was only with games that I bought, so I think I just wanted to get my money's worth out of these games, my time worth, and I didn't really understand the concept of time 
as much when I was little. I mean, keep in mind, this is probably when I'm like maybe six, seven. Um, and this was mostly true with uh, my favorite game, which is Kingdom Hearts 2. I never beat it until I was about maybe nine, maybe ten, I don't know. Uh, but I, I didn't like beating games mostly because it made me feel like, well, I shouldn't play this game anymore because I beat it. You know, there's no sense in me playing this game if I beat it. And I couldn't have been more wrong. If I enjoy the game, I should play it um, as much as I want to. But I used to always get near the end of a game and just reset. I... and... The only differences were Jack and Jack didn't crash CTR and games that I rented, which I rented games real often. Like, it was crazy how often I rented games. Um, and I would always beat them. There were a few instances where I didn't beat the games, but probably about 90% of the time I would beat the games in a night. And, you know... Mm, my mom would just end up being like, well, I'm just not going to buy you games because you're going to end up beating them. To which I replied, well, I don't beat games if you buy them. Um, it just, it never really clicked to me that I should beat the games and replay them. And so I started beating them and I started with Kingdom Hearts 2. And, uh, it went off into uh, Ratchet and Clank 3, Sly, um, the other Jack games, and um, just any other games I had lying around, like Tony Hawk, and uh, other stuff. Hold on, 